Good morning. Today is day three of putting in the garden. I watered that loose soil thoroughly last night because I really wanted to see how it's going to pack together and if I needed to add more soil amendment. I'm going to make a quick run to town this morning. My camera's wobbling around like a crazy thing. I'm going to make a quick trip to town today and pick up some more soil amendments because I found that my soil is very clay-like. It was so fine before we watered it that now it's kind of um, bulking together into like a hard mass. And I know that's not the most ideal for certain types of vegetables and roots. And we're going to go ahead and add some more topsoil-like things so that we can have the healthiest plants possible. All right, so that's what I'm doing. I'm off. We're still on the project. It's going well. It's, you know, you learn as you go. Talk to you later. I had to make a quick stop for the important things. Iced caramel latte, apple chips. I'm a little hungry and that's never good when you go to the store and you're running around. It can make you feel kind of cranky in the afternoon so or at least it does to me so I'm gonna have a little bit of a snack and I'm gonna get to the store as you can see I've already gotten quite a bit of soil conditioner so now I'm running into town to pick up compost and some grapes I want grapes I actually live on grapes and apple chips for the most part, and a nice salad. Don't forget the grapes. It is another beautiful day. The weather turned so quickly. Last week, it was still in the 30s at night. And this week, it's 55 at night and beautiful 75 to 80 during the day. Can't beat it. Well, I somehow managed to get about 40 bags of soil and conditioners into my car. I don't know how, but I did. Never let anybody tell you that it won't fit, because it will. Anyways, so now the hard part. I've got to get it all out, and then I can show you what I bought. for a short break. Half a cup of ice water and a back. This is Happy Frog Soil Conditioner. It contains bat guano and earthworm castings. It's just a good, rich nutrient base for the plants that are going in the garden. I've got five bags of that. I got 20 bags of the Expert Gardener Garden Soil, just to kind of beef up the soil we already have. And then I also got 15 more bags of this garden compost so that the soil isn't so clay-like and 
there's better drainage in the soil so that the roots can grow better and especially our root vegetables will have more space to grow and then also i got another four bags of the perlite which is just it really helps with drainage and so this will all go into the beds in the garden and then we'll mix it up and i'll create my rows and we'll get started with planting i hope once the sun goes down a little bit i'll be able to actually get outside and start getting some more of the you know hand tilling done i also picked these raspberry plants up when i was out today to add to the raspberry plants we planted yesterday and also a hummingbird feeder and some mix to make the hummingbird liquid I've noticed that there's a lot of hummingbirds trying to get nectar from the blossoms of this apricot tree. I'm going to go ahead and hang the hummingbird feeder from one of these low branches since they seem to like coming to it so often. is to get the soil conditioners onto the garden beds tomorrow so I need to try to get the ground broken up just a little before we do that in the morning. That is where we're at and that is what I'm working on now. After mixing the garden some more, I'm thinking that I'm going to need to pick up probably another 20 bags of garden soil. So I'm going to get that done now so it doesn't set us back tomorrow. It'll be cooler in the morning anyways to finish doing this. So I think I'm going to do it that way. Off to the store. Well, I made it back from the store. I got 20 bags of garden soil and I ended up with another raspberry plant. It's time to start watering for the evening. It's starting to cool down, the plants have cooled down, so it's time to give them some water so they can be ready for tomorrow. I didn't get everything done that I wanted to do today, but I had pretty high expectations. So I don't feel too badly about the things I didn't manage to accomplish. I'm looking forward to working in the garden again tomorrow and really getting the soil ready for planting. And the goal is to be starting to put things into the ground by the end of the week. We have a very short grow cycle here. Uh, winter comes early and it lasts a very long time. So sorry about my dogs. They're playing. They're adorable because two of them are still puppies, but 
they don't help with the video. As you can see, they're they're very lively. They're having a great time. So this is where we're gonna wrap up today's gardening video. I think we did accomplish a lot. I took a lot of trips to the store, which took more time than I wanted, but I'm happy with what I got done. Tomorrow's another day and we will tackle it with all our energy. Everybody have a great night. Be safe out there. If you like the video, please subscribe so that you can see us in the next video. Have a good night. Take care.